right, thank you for that, Eric. Well, a multicultural church service has grown to be very popular. The All Nations service at Faith Temple Church is in just a couple of weeks here in Rapid City. Now, joining us from the church this morning is Bishop Carr and his wife, Tawana Carr. Good morning to both of you. All right, so from what I hear, um, Tawana, this was kind of your idea uh, nearly 11 years ago. Yes. Um, well, during the month of February, we do have um, Black Celebrate Black History Month, and we do um, have, like, concerts and facts about mm -hmm. um, black history. And then I just thought since we were a multicultural, multiracial church that it would be a good idea to celebrate all nations. And um, so I went to my pastor at the time who is um, the late um, Bishop Kelly and, and told him what I thought and he told me to go for it. And so here we are today uh, about 11 years later. So, so you kind of form this service into what it is. Um, what is it exactly? What kind of happens during the service? So during the service, we um, um, invite everyone to celebrate your culture, your region, your state. We have um, people who are from Wisconsin who will do their cheese. And, <laughs> and, um, and so I am a, a self-proclaimed half Italian. So I would... Um, dress up as an Italian person. So um, we like to celebrate every culture. And and after the service, we go downstairs and we have what we call a marketplace. And in the marketplace, you can go through and do little tasters around the world um, or what you want to represent. Mm -hmm. And during that time, you have tasters. We have businesses who uh, want to um, get their businesses out there. And so it's just a wonderful time. Sounds like it's grown to be a lot. Bishop Carr, how, have you, how do you kind of uh, I guess, move your service around to adapt the All Nations Day service? Well, one of the things that's unique about the service is we try to have different languages. We have everybody dress in their cultural um, garments or whatever typically uh, your culture wears. And so all of that is woven into the into the service, the music, even the oh, okay. uh, we have multicultural music. And so every aspect of a person's culture, we try to incorporate in the service. And have you seen this kind of the I guess the popularity and the enticement and the hype around it kind of grow over the years? I think it does. Um, year over year, we want to make it a community mm -hmm. event. Um, so we invite everyone who would want to attend because, again, basically, um, we just want to all get together, all people, yeah. all nations get yeah. together. So if you, I, since it is a community event, everyone's invited. When is it? When are the details? It looks like it's coming up in just a couple yes, of weeks. Yes, it is in a couple of weeks. It will be February 25th, the last Sunday of this month. Um, the services start at 10 o'clock. And uh, we invite, if you would like to come, um, and the Faith Church is downtown, right? The downtown. 715 mm -hmm. Kansas City right. Street. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Right next to the Doll Arts Center, right? Yeah. All right. Perfect. Thanks for joining us this morning, guys. Thank you. Great learning about this event and the popularity, of course. We'll see you right after the break.